Hello everyone, this is Marky. Today I'm gonna talk about this topic When can you travel to Japan? I think some of you think that Is Japan open travel? I don't want to quarantine anymore Actually, from March 1st, travel restriction will be eased So, let's have a look First of all, I'll say that this video focus on the people for sightseeing in Japan. So if your purpose is for business or study, please contact with the person concerned. Also, Japan is not open the border completely. There is a limit to the number of visitors. It changed from 3,500 people to 5,000 people per day on March 1st. So please keep in mind that let me get straight to the point. Basically, you can come to Japan right now. But depending on your situation, some of you must quarantine and others don't need to. Let's see more detail. In this case, we need to check these two points. First, where is your departure country? Two, you already had a booster shot or not. Here's the table showing the situations. If your departure place is designated countries and you haven't got booster shot, you need quarantine at the designated facilities in 3 days. If your departure place is designated countries but you have already got booster shot or the place is not designated countries but you have not got booster shot. You need quarantine at the, your own place in 7 days. However, if you take the PCR test on the third day from entry into Japan, you can leave from quarantine. Lastly, if your departure place is not designated countries and you have already got booster shot, you don't need quarantine. By the way, as of March 3rd, Designated countries are below. Also, you can see more information on this website. This page shows not only the quarantine information, but also required documents, so please find it. Also, during the quarantine, you can use public transportation like bus, taxis, or trains just within 24 hours after your arrival for heading to your quarantine place. Actually, about two months ago, I came back to Japan from the Philippines, and at that time, we cannot use transportation at all. At all. We must use hired car to my home. Guess what? Do you know how much I spent? It is about 40,000 yen. 40,000. Just going home, I spent 40,000 yen. Anyway, I was feeling like I was VIP, so not bad though. Let me explain the situation in Japan. Japan opened the border step by step, but the pandemic is not over yet. Still, we have 60 to 80,000 patients with COVID-19 in every day. According to NHK, the hospitals in Tokyo are over 50% of capacity. And um, I watched the news, it said some hospitals couldn't receive the emergency patients because they don't afford to do them. On the other hand, uh, in Tokyo, almost all restaurants and the tourist spots are open as usual. But just in case, if you have any places you definitely want to go, I recommend you to research that information before going to there. And this is the most important part. You need to wear face mask when you are outside. I heard some countries decided not to be duty to wearing the masks, but Japan is not. 99% of people wear masks here to avoid infection, so don't forget to bring your face mask. I would like to wrap up this video. 
So you should check the conditions to points. First, have you got the booster shot? And second, uh, where is your departure country? And lastly, you should wear a face mask outside of your room. Don't forget that. I hope you're safe trip and having a good time in Japan. See you next video. Bye.